Uranus Sparkles and Surprises. In this video, created, directed, and presented by Reverend Dr. Dickie Jo Mullen, she discusses how Uranus sparkles and surprises us through each period of our lives. This is astrologer Dickie Jo Mullen with thoughts about sparkles and surprises at different times in your life with the cycle of the planet Uranus. Uranus represents the electrical and breakthroughs. It's a planet that relates to technology and astrology. It takes 84 years, about, for Uranus to circle the sun, and it stays in each of the 12 zodiac signs six to seven years. The cycle of Uranus represents different life passages. Now, your own birth chart, Uranus, um, as far as house and sign and aspect modifies this, but these are certain phases we can all look at. At um, ages 14 and 70, Uranus will make a 60 degree angle called a sextile to its natal place. This is an awakening of new friends and fresh ideas. At age 14, that's about when high school starts, and age 70 has often to do with settling into a second phase of career or retirement. And a freedom from responsibility and new interests represents the second sextile at right around age 70. The Uranus square, Uranus squaring its natal place, hits everybody for the first time at about age 21. This is a break from family, the age of majority, self-sufficiency, independence. Many people marry on impulse at around age 21, and that may or may not be a good idea. And there's the sense of finally being grown up. We can do what we want to do when we want to do it. Age 63 to around 65, depending on Uranus retrogrades and so forth, is Uranus squaring its natal place again. The old dog knows new tricks, adjustment to changes, deeper values, fed up with a few things. A lot of people walk out on a job or career when Uranus squares its natal place the second time at around age 63. Just all of a sudden, and I see this a lot with my clients, they'll say all of a sudden I knew I was out of there, it was over. And depending on how strong Uranus is in the birth chart, that actually happens quite a lot. Uranus opposes its natal place just once in an average lifespan, unless someone's found the fountain of youth. That happens only at about age 42. And this is the traditional midlife crisis aspect. A lot of people who married in haste at age 21 will be getting a divorce at age 42. And there's uncertainty. There seems to be uh, different choices and if there is a chance to just sort of get away from the old and all of a sudden if someone's been driving a very modest little sedan they might get say a red sports car something along those lines. Uranus suppose its natal place there can be a different choice in people and companionships and again that's a traditional divorce aspect. Uranus trines its natal place at age 28 for the first time. This is a creative cycle. There's a lot of barriers broken. A lot of people get into metaphysics, spiritual work, astrology right around age 27, 28. The second Uranus trine to the natal place is at about age 56. And that's freedom is established, humanitarian values, and again, deeper spiritual and metaphysical interests can become very important. The Uranus return, for those of us who are lucky enough to reach it, that occurs between age 83 to 85, usually at age 84. There are a lot of people that pass away, both of my parents did, right on their Uranus returns at right around age 83, or shortly before that. 
It represents the death or end of an old way of life, but for many it can mean a sparkle of humor, new meanings, um, or it could be a second childhood, I guess. And if you survive and make it all the way through the Uranus return, now Uranus retrogrades back and forth, so the return before it actually passes over the degree of the zodiac it was in at birth, there can be a couple of passages. It's all the way through for everybody by 85. If you make it past that, it's hard to kill you because you might live to be 100 years old. The centurions, which I understand is the largest group of population growing um, as far as statistics of how many there are and how many are becoming centurions, 100-year-olds, um, are those that have made it through the Uranus return. So if you did make it through that and are pushing 85, just hold on, relax, and enjoy life. You'll be with us for a long time. This is astrologer Dickie Joe Mullen, hoping this brought you a little sparkle and surprise.